How we feel about drinking oftentimes depends on our perspective. You and I, for example, may think about drinking as something pleasant. A glass of wine with dinner, a cocktail at a party with friends. But spend your weekends in an emergency room, and before long, your perspective begins to change. Every day of the year, these doctors and nurses deal with blood and pain, the human wreckage of car accidents, bar fights, arguments between husbands and wives. And according to a number of studies, many of the injured who are brought here are drunk. One third of all uh, admissions to emergency rooms are related to uh, injury. Hand injuries, domestic violence, uh, farm accidents, industrial accidents, motor vehicle accidents, uh, the knife wounds, the gunshot wounds. If you take all of those people, 50% will have significant blood alcohol levels. I'm not sure there is such a thing as being drunk and being at low risk for some kind of injury. If uh, there is some danger out there and you will always increase it by impairing your judgment. It's time to move on. We have another stop to make in the Mission District of San Francisco, the Pomeroy House, a home for women alcoholics and their children. This is a rescue operation for women who are desperate. They arrive without much money or hope. Many have children, some are running away from a man who beats them. All of them are alcoholics. Drinking and violence were woven together in their daily lives. They got drunk and someone got hurt. Too often, it was their children. I realize now what I did was child abuse. At that time, I thought it was discipline. What did you do? Well, at first it was spanking. And um, as my drinking got worse, I became out of control, you know, and um, I would pick him up by his arm, you know, and hit him like this, and, and he would fight to get away, and I would fight harder to get back at him, and or to get him under control, and um, pushing, I did, you know, a lot of pushing. and Shove him around? Yeah, and I just felt really out of control, and it was like my anger would come up, and it would just, I would just lose it. 